Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario 64. So, in the last episode... In the last episode, uh... We finished up, uh, Lava Lava Island stuff and came here instead. So, in this episode, we're just going through and... I have some people I want to talk to. Mario Heart, please take good care of my brother, okay? Come on, we're in a hurry, Gambaria. Seriously, you're so obnoxious sometimes. Be quiet! Mario, you're looking just fine, aren't you? Best be careful not to be a burden on Mario's adventure. Hey, no way am I a burden. I help out all the time. Well, well, our dear little Gumbario is helping out the great Mario. I'm so proud, her. I'm gonna tell Dad and Goompa. Mario, you have, must come over to our house again sometime. Come on, stop it, Mom. You're embarrassing me. I'm not a kid anymore. Oh, don't be silly, Pumpkin. I'm not saying anything like embarrassing at all. I just love you, that's all. Can't a mother be proud of her children? Oh, Mom. You always treat me like a kid. Nya nya, Goombaria's getting scolded. Shut up, Goombaria. Mom, Mom, Goombaria's being mean. She's my mom, Goombama. <laughs> she sometimes gets on my nerves when she worries too much about me, but I still love her lots. Don't tell her what I just said. Seriously, Mario, promise me. This is the residential... She's my sister, Gumbaria. She's a spoiled girl, but still, she's always... Everyone's so nice to her. Why? Whatever. Well, that's his family. So I could come over here and do this, but why would I freaking talk to that guy again? He's a dick. I've never talked to that guy. So for now, instead of actually doing story stuff, I actually want to head over here and head down to Toe Town Tunnels to show off some stuff. So now, I showed off heading down into here before. And I'm not sure how much I showed down here, but there's an entire right section that now we can do with sushi, and we can also head left. We can head... We could already head in there, but... I think over here? I, yeah, it's a super block up there. So, now that... I don't want to show this off just because, you know, it's, it's a freaking super block. Why would I ever freaking show that off? That wouldn't have made any sense. We didn't have any party members to show off. It, it would have spoiled so much. It just freaking. But now we have uh, the ability to do ultra rank, which is awesome. Now that we can do ultra rank, I can just float across here. By the way, guys, I just realized something. We're almost done with this game. We have like two chapters left. With this, you can upgrade one of your party members. Which member do you want to upgrade? So that's actually a hard choice. Um. Uh, attacks all enemies, Mega Bomb, Fire Show. Okay, considering the area we're going to next, I kind of want to have Cooper. No, actually, I kind of want to have... This is a hard choice. I'm just going to start upgrading people at random. I think Paracarry is pretty cool, so I'm going to upgrade him. I don't know who I'm going to be upgrading, but there are more blocks to find, so I need to go around and find all of this. Paracarry is upgraded to Ultra Rank. So now we can head over here, switch out for sushi, because we need to head right from over here. I am healed, right? I'm not healed. Oh well. I don't think there's any bad enemy do down here, and if there is, then we'll all screw. Oh well. Blooper! Motherfuck! Really? I told- What? There's a third one? How is there a third one? I totally forgot that- <sighs> Okay. Fuck. Guys, I'm already dead. There's no way I can win this battle because I don't have any of the stuff I need. Um, right off the bat, I'm gonna focus. And switch over to Gumbario. Alright. Reduce the damage to two. Gumbario, tattle him. Super blooper. This is super blooper. Whoa, it's huge. Easily the biggest blooper ever. Max HP 70, attack power 5, defense power 0. Trust me, its size doesn't lie. It's pretty powerful when it gets mad, it turns red, and its power goes way up. And sometimes it spawns little blooper babies. Buckle down, Mario, we're in for a fight. And I'm not fully healed for this battle, because I totally forgot about this. <sighs> Alright. Well. Okay. I have some items to use. Let's just do this battle. There. Okay. Start off the battle with six damage. 
Ah, oh, crap, it's getting red. Oh no, it's getting babies. Um, sure, why not? Tattle one of the babies. This is a blooper baby. This is a blooper baby. Super blooper spits them out and they come out to drain you. Max HP 6, attack power 2, defense power 0. We need to beat them quickly so they can't drain the stride. They're so cute, though. I would, honestly, if they were more threatening, I would probably focus more on them. I'm not going to, though. Because I have damage production. Actually, I just realized that they're this kind of enemy. They're pretty much fuzzy. See, I'm gonna destroy them next turn then. I didn't really think about that. And now it's getting red. Sometimes I'm definitely hiding. <laughs> I don't want any part of this. Yeah, I'm really lucky she's so useful. Okay. Let's use... Could use that. I'm just gonna use a Star Storm. I know it's probably not my best idea. Doing it anyway. Deal seven damage and will destroy the babies in one shot. 51 HP. It's not so tough anymore, is he? And I'm only right when I say that this happens. Um. Yeah. So now we're in this situation. I'm going to do out of sight again, I think. Probably my best idea. No. Yeah, no. Doing it like this. Just deal five more damage like this. I figure if I can end the fight earlier, it's probably the best. Is he spawning more babies or is he turning red? Spawning more babies. Five damage each. Why isn't it? Why did that not turn left at all? I could be dead here, guys. Unless she turns red instead. So he's dead. Use the string red instead. Killing that guy. Out of sight. Out of sight, out of mind, right? Heal up a bit. I know it won't deal as much damage, but I'd like to survive this battle. So, you know. 5 HP and FP back. There, only 2 damage. Alright. Now, I think we're gonna win this. I think we can do this, guys. I was not expecting this. I was not prepared for this. Alright down to 25 HP, and more freaking babies. Alright, I'm gonna kill this baby. I really wish I was more prepared for this. Fuzzy look like. Out of sight, for sure. Oh, 
this could get really bad really quickly if I fail in one part. Also, I should probably do the turn order a bit different. I shouldn't switch to her. I'm down to this. So, one more turn. I think we're fine, but all the same. Actually, wait, I don't need to do anything, right? I'm not attacking you. And you just spawn more babies. Come, come, my lady. Come, come, my lady. You're my butterfly. I'm my, my baby. Dead. Oh my gosh, that could have been really freaking bad. Alright, 25 freaking star points for being that one. Am I really gonna lose the babies? Should I even risk it? I don't, really don't want to risk this. I I shouldn't be able to lose. Yeah. Let's just think that way. Let's just. Geez. Okay, I don't know why that doesn't work at all. My thing doesn't even. Whatever. It's fine. I'm in peril. I'm fine. I win. Game over, guys. Oh my god, they're at 26 star points. Don't care. Long hair, don't care. Gonna go put on some underwear. And now, we're on Yoshi Island, also known as Lava Lava Island. Definitely saving here. That's not enough for an episode because I've been kind of cheaping out doing just boss fight episodes. So, I'm gonna heal here and I'm gonna take you back down into the sewers. Alright guys, we're back here. Uh, I had to do a little bit of... Oh, come on! Alright, that fight's over. It was real easy. Uh, no new enemies at all, yada yada. Oh, come on again! There we go. Now that those guys are all dead, I'm so freaking tired of those guys. Can't do anything there. I'm just running by things that I can't do anything with right now. I don't think I can do anything up to this point. So I might be wasting my time here, guys. Wait. I think Bombette? I know it's kind of an odd way of doing things here, but I'm not really, uh, sure. It's been a while since I've been to this here. This is the guy I was talking about. Well, well, look here, hello, 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 Rip Cheeto on uh, your service. You're quite an enter entrepreneur, enterprising fellow, fighting this place. What am I doing here? Just doing a little business and minding my own. You, my friend, have just stumbled into great fortune, for I have a, a great deal for you. I have something special. It costs only 64 coins. Deal? Trust me, it's a bargain. Got a start piece. So... This is the guy I was talking about. So, I'm gonna buy from him again, and I get a life shroom. Buy from him again, and get a bump attack. Let's Mario destroy a weaker enemy in the field by hitting it, just by touching it. Get a repel gel. That's fine. I've spent all my money at his place now. Yeah, every single penny of it. And it kind of sucks, but you got plenty of good items for it. Now you get an odd key opens door somewhere in Toe Town. I wonder where that somewhere is. I haven't really told, hinted to it, but it's right here. Right next to the entrance to the sewer. So if you ever want to get to Rip Cheeto, it's right there. Uh, Rip Cheeto has fantastic items, including star pieces, and a bunch of awesome badges, like the Bump Attack badge, which is... Where is it? Was it at the top? I don't know, it's right down there. It costs five, but if you're going to old areas, literally put it on. No excuse not to put it on. Take off some badges you, you like need and just put it on. And then you just need to walk into an enemy and they die instantly. It's great for side quest stuff. Now, I know there's some... S should I do side quest stuff or should I go on? Should we go on the story, guys? That's the question. Uh, I do need to do one thing. I forgot to get the, uh, 
flower seed thing uh, inside of Forever Forest. So I'm gonna go do that. I'll be right back. I think I showed that off already. If not, I'll just show the location of it. Insta kill. Actually, I'm gonna be showing off where you need to go from here to get there. So, from here, you have to head first to the second one on your left. Head in here. And with this bump badge, it makes everything so much more easier. Whatever, I don't care about you. But you do give a coin, but I don't care about single coins, so I'm not gonna waste my time. Head one left, and you can find this one with the red eyes. Head left here. Oh no, this is where this guy's. I feel as though I can hear the stars crying even now. Oh, I'm sorry. Run through this one, I think. I think that's right. Yeah, through this one, and now you're here. Hey, hello there! I'm a bubble from the land called Flower Fields. A flower seed? <laughs> Should I give it to you or shouldn't I? Well, I suppose I'll give it to you. Here you go. Please plant it somewhere nice and take extra good care of it. If you plant it somewhere bad and find and I find out of it, I might have placed a curse on you. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of gone crazy in this forest. But all the same, it's kind of important to grab that or something. I could head this way and do that, but there, just want to... Ah, we got nothing for killing that guy, whatever. I'm just going to go the wrong way and teleport back to the beginning, and then head back here. But this was the... Oh, this is the way backwards. Okay. So if you head in here, this is the wrong way. And now you head back. And now you're out of the forest. So I just want to show that off. Uh, I also took off my Power Plus badge since I'm not going to be using it for a little bit. And I'm trying to think, what should I do next? I Maybe I'll go around and record some bonus episodes and stuff? I don't know. What do we have in the badge shop for now? We have the Charge Hammer, the Super Smash Charge. When Super Charge Mario's a hammer attack goes up by 3. Jump Charge goes up by 2. And Double Dip lets you use 2 items in 1 turn. A really good item so that you can like deal like insta kills and a lot of enemies but waste your items quickly so it's really up to you um guys i know what i'm gonna do to finish off this episode i know i told you there'd be more to this episode so okay there's major slowdown going on i need to figure out what's going on just a minute Guys, I think it's fixed. I also took the liberty of healing myself, so let's talk to the Grand Master. <coughs> oh, hello, Mario. Welcome to our dojo. For what purpose did you come here today? Very well. It's time you fought the master. This should be an easy battle now, but I took off my damage increasing thing, so I'm an idiot. Um, I also didn't attack. I didn't equip any good badges, so I'm an idiot even more. Oh well. Hmm, excellent move. Alright, tattle him. This is the master. He owns the dojo and he's the strongest member. Max HP 50, attack 6, and defense 0. He's, if he's the best in the dojo, then he must be tough. He's pretty slow, though, so I don't know about that. Um, what I do know is that I'm dealing a lot of damage to him. Also, I should probably use my hammer since it's stronger than my boots right now. Oh well. Let's just use multi -bunk. Do not even need to practice that. I'm getting it down a bit better. Oh well. Um, he's attacking with good amount of damage, but let's just deal a good amount of damage ourselves. So, <laughs> excellent move. He's already halfway dead. So let's hope I can do another good one. Okay, really? That was terrible. Alright, I can take one more hit, so let's just go for a strong hit here and see if we can beat him. Six damage there, so I need 14, so let's do this. 
Okay, that was terrible. You have natural talent. Yeah, we're gonna beat him this turn. Six damage here. Oh, eight damage, I'm sorry. I why did I Oh right, I'm in damage. I'm in damage power charge thing, right? Alright, power rush, I think that's what the name of the badge is, right? I see why you are so famous, Mario. You are truly a masterful fighter. Very well with the adversaries. I give you this third degree card. If you are all oh, you're welcome to train here anytime. <clears throat> so we can actually fight a stronger enemy there. We just I don't know if I can do it right now. So for the moment I'm gonna heal up and then we're gonna try that enemy. Alright? If not, then I'll meet you back after I lose or something. I don't know right now. Alright, you ready? Mario, you will fall! And he's turned into some kind of genie thing. This is terrifying. I also forgot to equip my badges because I'm you know, usual. This is the master. He owns the dojo and he's still the strongest member. And max HP 75, attack power 8, and defense power 0. He knows both normal and advanced methods of attack. He best concentrate, Mario. This guy doesn't mess around at all. See, so yeah, he's kind of freaking powerful. So, let's just damage him. <laughs> nice maneuver. Ah, crap. Seven damage, yeah. Alright, let's just use the attack. And now, multi bonk. I guess that's like five or like one extra. Whatever. Um. How much would I be healed by? I'll cover 20 HP. I'll wait to do that. Let's try this. If we can put him to sleep, then this should be an easy battle. Uh, this is gonna be difficult as can be. Nope, he didn't get put to sleep. Oh well. That was terrible. Alright, let's heal up this turn. Smooch. We're gonna make out with the Star Spirit. That's right. You don't tell me what I can and can't do. Now, let's use Charge this turn. Let's see how this works. Alright. Let's use Hammer to deal more damage. He's down to 44 HP already. Alright, multibonk, let's see if we can do this. Okay, failed. Freaking failed. I really need to work on that. Alright, let's see. I don't think I'll be able to do this, guys. Don't lose your concentration, have to- I've yet to truly begin fighting back. Oh my- That's so cheap! That's so cheap! Okay, no! Guys, caking it. You can't stop me now, I'm going to have a good time. Wait, what? Why didn't it heal me? Do items not work? And I freaking failed that. Don't lose your concentration. I have to start by that. Yeah, that is so cheap. And I lost. And apparently my cake doesn't heal me for some reason. And I got revived by that, which was such a waste. I was hoping to use that later. Oh well. I'm kinda pissed. Hmm, <laughs> let's do my Nova. Multibonk.
down to six. I can beat him with the next attack. All right, let's hit him. I'm surprised I actually won this. I needed to use a life stream to do it, but it was worth it. I'm still pissed that I wasted my cake. All right, I got the fourth degree card. You're welcome to train here with us anytime. <laughs> Alright, and with that, we are officially done with that. Or at least we're not done yet. There's still something we can do there, but I'm not going to be able to do that now. Are you kidding me? Final thing before we end the video, I would like to enter the post office here. Yes, hello, this is the post office. You can read any letters. I was you to have some mail. Which one would you like to read? For everyone. Gumbario. I, wait, I don't know if, I guess I never read these again, so I'll do these again. Dear Gambario, how are you, my cute Gambario? We're all doing fine here. I hope your town and abilities finally become useful. Stop by whenever you get the chance. We all miss you. Good luck, my little Goomba. I'll be thinking of you. For Gambario as well. Goomba. Actually, I already read all these. I remember. I have 100% memory of reading all these because I remember reading the uh, Red and Blue Goombas one. Cooper. Coover. And dear Cooper, how goes the adventure? I can't believe you're hanging in with Mario. I'm so jealous. Cooper Voge is the same. Colorado's wife is impatiently waiting for Colorado's return. You and Colorado, you guys have so much excitement in your lives. You're so lucky. Anyways, good luck, buddy. Cooper of Cooper Village. I, I screwed up. Colorado's wife. I think I ever read this one. Cooper, how are you doing? Your mother dropped my fruit this the other day. It was tea. Blah, blah, blah. Goombet. Dry, dry railroad. I know I read this one, so I'm just going to skip through it because I hate having this still highlighted. But this one's new. Bruce. Love letter to Bombet from Bruce. Here you go. Bumbet, you you must return to me, oh fair and combustible Bobom. My heart awaits you in Koopa Village. It burns like a fuse. I will love you forever, even if you reject me. My love will endure. If I don't see you soon, I'm sure we explode. So please hurry. You've ignited my passion. Come to me, my love. Your Bruce. Yeah, that guy's weird. Um, Perry Carry, Frosty. Dear Perigary, thank you for always delivering my mail, despite snow and ice. Because I live in this cold valley so far from my family, the letters I receive are my greatest pleasure in life. Kind words from my wife and daughter give me the strength to continue my work. My heart leaps with joy every time I hear the sounds of your wings. May you never molt. Your fan frosty. Alright, how about Bo? From Bootler. Here you go. To Lady Bo. Please return as quickly as possible. I cannot shed the image of you in some sort of danger. Uh, if you worries me that I can no, no, it worries me so that I can no longer sleep. When you went with Mario, you told me not to not go with you. But now I regret my obedience. I should have gone anyway and protected you from harm. Now all I can do is wish the stars that the other booze, with the other booze, that you return safely. Please take care, Bootler. All right, and with Bo as well. Let's get a letter from the booze. Here you go. Dear Lady Bo, thank you for rescuing us from this horrible tubble blubble up on Ghosty Gulch. We never dreamed we'd meet a boo of your stature. The sight of you alone would have been enough to keep us going, but you went ahead and defeated Tubble Bubba too. We thought that our friends were done for when they were eaten, but they were all returned. Many thanks now that we're done now that you're done on your quest worth oh, when you're done on your quest we're throwing you a party, please come. Oh and please say hi to everyone at Boo's Mansion. The Boo's at Ghosty Gulch. Alright, now what? From Fuzzy Peed. What? Here you go. Dear what? Well, I'm still kicking. I ain't gonna be bait no more. I reckon I appreciate the help of you and your buddies. This letter here would be my thanks, so we're even, alrighty? Anywho, good luck doing what y'all do, and don't be bothering me if you want to meet up again, Fuzzy Peed. I guess that's the guy who was inside of the whale's stomach. Uh, so guys, next time on Let's Play Paper Mario 64, we're gonna move on inside the story, I think. I don't think I want to do more side stuff right now. I will be recording the bonus videos for the other areas soon, so look forward to that. So guys, I'll see you guys then.